gonna do basically I'm, I'm basically i'll tell you guys exactly what i'm gonna do so you, you you know what i'm gonna say i'm gonna write an email to fide i'm gonna write an email to, to the president and find out if that's really their intention and if that's their intention i am gonna organize a match just to play nine games um i'll just i'll just i'll just find i'll just find people out here who are fide rated i'll just play nine games against them so that that's what i'm gonna do uh just so you guys are aware that's what i'm gonna do so like I mean we'll see if if they choose to waive that and if they don't then then yeah I, I mean if they ha if they keep that silly rule in place I'm just gonna play a match against someone and yeah they can be mad at me all all they want for it but I mean the, their rule is stupid so I'm actually gonna do that yeah yeah yeah. Would FIDE not need to approve? No, as long as there's as long as there's an arbiter here who um an arbiter who can who can confirm that it's like it's a fair match that you're playing. You know, Still ninety six. Oh my god, ninety six. Ninety six. Oh, oh my, my goodness, god. he missed it. He missed it. That would have been the turnaround. Oh my god, Armand, that was winning for white. Can you believe that? And I oh think my goodness, we need an instant replay right here. Bishop takes c four, ninety six, and black and resign. It's crazy. Everything. The house falls. Oh my goodness. This Oh, he's now down to 10 seconds. F4. Knight. Whoa. Whoa. Was that necessary? Take on h6, surely. Rook g3, defending c3. He doubles. Now, this is unplayable with one second, though, is it? How is Duda doing this? King is going to hide on a1, and Black's King is going to be the one that's unsafe. Unbelievable. Oh, my God. It's winning. Oh, my lands. Black it's is winning. Needed. H7. No, but King takes h7. Oh my god, what is happening now? Knight, knight, knight b3. <laughs> takes. King b2. White's hidden. Knight f8 is coming. You got a sack oh on b3. Goodness. Knight f8. Queen takes f8. Queen takes Holy f8. Smokes. Where does the king oh, go? Oh, rook g7? Knight. Wait, king takes h6. Oh, he's pretty he mouse slipped. Oh, oh my god, he mouse slipped. Oh, what oh a mouse god. slip. I don't even god know what was happening after that. He can't catch a break. He keeps coming back in the most... He pushed b4, bishop takes b4, so queen c8, king e7, bishop e3, b4, bishop b4, mate. He missed. He missed queen h5, mate. He missed queen h5, he check missed queen and h5 the Kirill Shevchenko becomes me. the winner of this he tournament. He missed queen h5, mate. Unbelievable. Wow, look at that. He can't believe it he himself. Can't believe He's won the that tournament. A uh, box should be in the SEC. Um... Benjamin is it, the thing with Benjamin is quite the opposite. I think Benjamin without increment he would he would get murdered, but with increment I think he'd be extremely dangerous in the format. Um. Yeah, I feel like this table or the camera or something has moved. I feel like I used to not get the tops of the paneled paintings behind me there, like see above the top. Looks a little. Tilted. I don't know if that's the look I'm going for. A little tilted. This must be winning somehow. Bishop e4, for example, just wins. Oh, wait, no, there's 96. Oh, my gosh, 96 was winning. Oh, my gosh, we're both idiots. 96 is winning here. E6, sure. I feel like his chances were higher with the bishops right, some on the board because now I just rook a1. Oh, king d4. Why put his king in check? What? what happened now? White played the move king d4. He put his king in check and he played king e3 d4. And that's why. Um, so now you have to know which rules they so have because the sometimes it's sure. losing the game and sometimes it's just that uh, one of the players. played an illegal move and pressed the clock, I think. He played king d4. Let's see what happens. Wow, drama. This is a powerful game from Ashbrock. This, this tells me Valentinian would. Like, he still can bend over for 400s. Ashbro is putting on a clinic right now. Daener Daenerys Dookie, thanks for the hundred bits. Where the oh, both of these? Okay, so what else do we have? Special place, special place, and if I stayed too long, I'd probably break down and cry. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god.
my god, what did I just watch? Oh my god. Huh. Oh no, my rook. It's totally unnecessary, by the way. Okay, check. The funny thing is, if it works, that'd be nice. I think it's it's working. Oh my goodness, it worked. <laughs> I confused him so much. <laughs> I can I confused him so much. Look, well, is it even a good move? I don't know. Is, is it? A, I mean, maybe it's a good move. It's the best move. Wait, it was the, it was kind of the best move. It's still plus. It's a really good move, actually. It's number two. It's eight. It it might be the best move in the position, actually. I think it's a, it, it is the best move in the position. Okay, whatever. Uh. <clears throat> Mr. Burfish, hello. Nice Pink to see. That's, I don't have many pink stuff actually. Hello. Thank you. Thank I'll you believe. for subscribing to Jesus. 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 Thank you. <laughs> Let's, Let's go. go. Czy tutaj H7 zaraz jakieś wlatuje? Dawaj odejść gdzieś tym skoczkiem, może jakiś mat się tutaj z tego urodzi, ale kto pierwszy ten lepszy? Mata nie ma, skoczek G3, tutaj Hetman zasłania, czy to jest po prostu kompletnie wygrana pozycja? Grozi skoczek F8, tak pozamiatane, pozamiatane proszę państwa w tym momencie, król czarnego, niesamowicie osłabiony, bicie HG, smysz kliknie! Nie, najgorzej. Upuścił wieżę. Who's harder to beat in blitz in your opinion, dude or Anish? I mean, definitely, if you mean like in a one-off game or a match, it means di different things. If you mean a one-off game, Anish is much harder to beat because his repertoire is so solid. Um, so he's much harder to beat in a one-off game. Uh, because Duda plays a lot of openings all over the place, plays a lot of wild openings, and so therefore they're gonna be there's gonna be a lot of variance, and there will be a lot of decisive games. Um, so I would say in a one-off game, I think that um, that, that on each is a lot harder to beat. In a match, I would say that um, I would say that uh, beating 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 uh, beating Duda though is a lot harder than beating on each, um, because because Duda is just very crafty, always finds creative ideas, and um, like in the match I played against him last year, he was really really resourceful. So very very tough opponent is is what I, would I think say. it's time. <laughs> I think it's time. <laughs> I'll just play some off stream games, guys. We'll, we'll be fine. We'll survive this. We'll survive this. We will survive this difficult times. <laughs> 1977. Alright, you know what? I need to eat a burger. This is not going any other way than down. This is not going. <laughs> Can we just laugh at this? I actually lost like 100 points of rating today. All right, it's fine. It's fine. We have places to go to. We'll be back. We'll be back. Can we actually just laugh at this? GG. Oh, yeah. GG. GG. Mm. I'm not happy about my rook being here. I think I'm going to go back. <gasps> no, this is... I just can't. no. You know what? I think I think I think we can't. I cannot play chess right now. I cannot play chess right now. Um, it's gonna be a Roni versus versus Fabiano next round. Yeah. No, I mean if if I had if I had forty five million dollars, I would probably literally donate like seventy percent of the money that I make on Twitch and and YouTube to um. I'd probably donate all of it to charity and just like keep the 30% that I would need for taxes or something like that. But um, but I'm not worth $45 million, so no worries, you guys. Thank you to Powderhound for the six months. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Uh, $45 million.